This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at the acid and base dissociation constants. Let's start with a review of weak acids and bases. Weak acids partially dissociate or ionize in solution. Here we have the reaction of ethanoic acid with water, forming the ethanoate ion and the hydronium ion. Weak bases also partially dissociate or ionize in solution. Here we have the reaction of ammonia with water forming the ammonium ion and the hydroxide ion. These are equilibrium reactions in which the equilibrium lies to the left, the reactant side. Next we look at the acid dissociation constant. Ka, which is the acid dissociation constant, is an equilibrium constant that refers to the dissociation or ionization of an acid. In this reaction, HA, which is a weak acid, reacts with water, forming the hydronium ion and the conjugate base of the weak acid. Here we have the expression for the acid dissociation constant. In the numerator, we have the concentration of the hydronium ion, which can also be written as H+, and the concentration of the conjugate base of the weak acid. In the denominator, we have the concentration of the weak acid. As you can see, water does not appear in the expression. Here we have the expression for the acid dissociation constant for the above reaction. In the numerator, we have the concentration of the ethanoate ion, which is the conjugate base of ethanoic acid, and the concentration of the hydronium ion. In the denominator, we have the concentration of the ethanoic acid. Next we look at Kb. Kb is an equilibrium constant that refers to the dissociation or ionization of a base. In this reaction we have a base B reacting with water to form the conjugate acid of the base and the hydroxide ion. Here we have the expression for the base dissociation constant. In the numerator we have the concentration of the conjugate acid of the base and the concentration of the hydroxide ions. In the denominator we have the concentration of the base. And once again, you'll notice that water does not appear in the expression. Here we have the expression for the base dissociation constant for the above reaction. In the numerator, we have the concentration of the ammonium ion, which is the conjugate acid of ammonia, and the concentration of the hydroxide ions. And in the denominator, we have the concentration of ammonia, 